Normal people can live with happiness. Screwed up people will try to destroy it. My dad has been married five times. Till I was 10, thought women were rent to own. <laughs> See, all I'm looking for is the perfect match. On our first date, my girlfriend Erin and I took a thermos of Bailey's and coffee and went on a romantic walk through the park. Except it was sprinkler night. <laughs> Being chivalrous, I bolted ahead. But Aaron, in heels and dressed to kill, never once changed stride. That was the night I fell in love with her. Her strength, her composure, and you could see her nipples. Eventually, we moved in together, so I could see him every day. They're my friends. Bye. Thanks for stopping by. See you guys later. Thanks a lot. 14 months into my relationship, I realize it's not an act. That's who she is. She's great. The perfect girl. I don't deserve this kind of happiness. How can I destroy it? You told that story again. Are you trying to piss me off? Wow. I thought screwing this up was going to be a lot harder. <laughs> About. You love it when I tell that story. I told you to stop it. No, you said <laughs> stop it. What I meant was, oh, stop it. Then you should say, oh, stop it. Now you're making fun of me? Yeah. <laughs> what kind of man are you? Aaron just started a little fight, which we will resolve and I'll be happy again. And frankly, I'm not comfortable with that. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I shouldn't have told that story. Thank you, sweetheart. That's all I wanted to hear. Mm -hmm. No, thank you for calling me on that. <laughs> Kristen used to call me on that kind of stuff all the time. <laughs> Kristen? Oh, man. She knew me inside and out. Oh, oh. And I don't know you at all? Oh, no, no, no. Don't be insecure about Kristen. I mean, you're you, and <sighs> Kristen was Kristen. Uh-huh. If she hadn't been killed in that horrible car wreck, who knows what my life would be like. <laughs> I, I mean, I never would have met you. My work here is done. <laughs> so in other words, you're breaking up with no, me? No, no, no. No other words. Those are the words. So we're broken up? Yes! Good, fine, we're broken up. Let the record show you broke up with me. Noted. Fine. I'm leaving. Oh no, I'm leaving. <laughs> Rookie. <laughs> Women have a post breakup 36 hour, I'm gonna eat cookies and cry, period. I have a three-minute, I don't need you anyway, so I'm gonna sleep with somebody that looks just like you to prove how much you didn't hurt me. <laughs> Period. What's the matter? She broke up with me. Aww. Want some pie? <laughs> okay. <laughs> hey, she broke up with me. So, uh, when do you get off? That's up to you. Oh. <laughs> um, I'm gonna go pack my stuff. No, you're not. Oh, you burned it. <laughs> I started the whole fight. I shouldn't be insecure about another woman. Especially a dead one. I love you, and I know how much you love me. Well, yeah. <laughs> just hug me. Can we just forget about last night and never bring it up again? I'm gonna hold you to that. <laughs> 
got you a present. Uh, uh, look at me, my cake, and I'm eating it. <laughs> so she brings out this monster basket of cookies and cards and cologne and poems, and as I eat her wonderful cookies, and I read her beautiful words, I realize I own her ass. Wow. This is really beautiful. Thank you. You misspelled worship. No, 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 no. That, that's an I. My tears made it run. Oh. Listen, since we're being totally honest, there's something I got to tell you. And it's my fault. I mean, I can't blame you for annoying me if you don't know you're annoying me. Annoying you? I'm sorry? No, don't apologize, hon. Do you know what you're doing wrong? <laughs> you're right. I'm sorry that I interrupted you. Yeah. <laughs> it's the way you brush your teeth. My teeth? Meet you in the bedroom. You know, nothing gets me hotter than a real good come hither loogie. Sorry, I, I, I didn't realize. I won't do it anymore. I don't want to upset my man. That makes me happy. I can make you happier. All this happiness is freaking me out. <laughs> One day, all my dreams will come true. <laughs> then what? Ford called. They want you to design your own car. The Titus. You've given my life direction. I'm running for city council. <laughs> Successful business. Terrific relationship, son. I'm so proud of you. This is great. I've never been happier. Excuse me. Just as well, he'd peaked. <laughs> I'll meet you in the bedroom. <laughs> oh, oh, but I'm kind of beat. So this time, could it just be my turn? <laughs> I know you're kidding. A stud like you would never let me go unsatisfied. <sighs> you're right. <laughs> oh, I'll get it. Don't forget to write it down this time. <laughs> Hello? Oh, uh, uh, he's busy. Sure. I'm writing it down. Okay. Bye bye. <laughs> Honey? Yeah? Who's Tiffany? <laughs> <laughs> Wrote it down. You broke up with me. But I love you so much, and I was all alone in the diner drinking coffee, and, and she gave me some sweet and low, and, I, and that's what I, I love you. You slept with her? I, well, she said, You want some pie? I didn't know it was a metaphor. <laughs> I love you. You slept with her? I had everything in my life bet on you, Christopher. You were my knight in shining armor. You were the one. Now you're just... Now you're just... Another guy. I had destroyed my relationship. Yes! <laughs> now I have something to fix. A goal. We fought for the next 12 hours. Finally. We came to an understanding. She owns my ass. <laughs> I, I want to make it up to you. How do you make it up to me? You were knee deep in waitress, and you want to make it up to me? <laughs> Boil yourself, and then we'll talk. <laughs> but I'm your little cabbie. <laughs> Don't ever say that again. <laughs> Look, what I did was wrong, okay? I, I, I am scum. I'm a Nets colon. I, I'm, I'm, I'm trash. I, I, I'm the scum inside of a Nets colon in the trash. I'll do anything. I will fix this. 
I am not going to be like my father. Well, my father doesn't want to be like my father. Hey, it was just a bad call. Bad call on your part. I cheated on my last wife with you. What did you think was gonna happen? Caveat emptor, baby. Great ass. All of Dad's relationships ended exactly the same. Subpoena, beep of a moving van backing up the driveway, pile of his clothes burning on the front lawn. Looks like we're going shopping. Honey, there's gotta be something I can do to make this right again. Okay. Tell me what she looks like. I don't remember. Oh, she must feel special. <laughs> like I do right now. No, 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 no. No, she, she looked like you. Oh! She looked like me! Only younger. <laughs> I mean, she's younger than you, and you look like her. <laughs> See, so as old as you are, you look really young. So, so if you look the way she looks now, when she's old, she's gonna look horrible. Now I feel pretty. <laughs> what do you want from me? You know, what I wanna know is, did you think of me when you were doing her, or did you never think of me at all? <laughs> okay, that's a trick question. <laughs> Don't move. <laughs> Let's hear what the little pie serving ho has to say. Oh, God, no more. <laughs> Both engines on fire. The gear won't deploy. The controls are frozen. <laughs> Shot down by a 22 year old waitress in breakaway panties. So you can leave one message at one place for both of us. Hey, Aaron, it's Randy. It's great seeing you last night. Don't! <laughs> Move. You left your sweater at my place. Why don't you come back and pick it up tonight? Call me. Boyfriend, Randy. My past girlfriends had the 36 hour eat cookies and cry period. Erin had the same thing, except she ate those cookies with a guy in bed. Naked. Hey, Randy. What did he do? Can't forget his dead girlfriend. I get off in 20 minutes. <laughs> oh, yeah. You can't eat all those cookies by yourself, can you? I hope you like the heart outside, because I can't get enough of the creamy middle. <laughs> Erin has slept with her old boyfriend. Therefore, I must not be good enough. So I will do everything in my power to win her back. And when she comes back, I shall make her life heaven for approximately nine to 14 days, then dump her, proving that I, indeed, am better than she. Continuing. Look, we, we both made mistakes. Let's just leave it at that. You are absolutely right. I totally forgive you. And I forgive you. Good. <laughs> Look at this place, huh? Yep. I will help you. <laughs> <sighs> honey. <laughs> so did you sleep with him? <laughs> Here's some honey. Let's just leave it alone, okay? Because I am with you now. Uh, I know. I just want to make sure, you know, we're on equal footing. You know? You slept with a waitress, and I hung out with an old boyfriend. <laughs> hung out. <laughs> you know, we gotta be totally honest with each other here. Sweetheart, it doesn't matter. I am with you. I know, and that's why I won't get mad. I just wanna know if you slept with him. Yes, I slept with him. <laughs> you whore! <laughs> whore? You, you were the one who couldn't wait, wait to get a slice of Tiffany pie! 
everyone come with me. Ha! Yeah, I had to sleep with a waitress free card. <laughs> hey, bro. Hey, bro. What the hell are you doing here? Eating chicken. <laughs> I can see that. How did you get in? You gave me keys for an emergency, remember? You had a chicken emergency? <laughs> Don't rag at me. I didn't sleep with Randy. <laughs> How long have you been here? Since, uh, looks like you only younger. <laughs> Look, Tommy's here too. Uh. I didn't get here till pie serving ho. <laughs> Christopher, we were worried about you. You didn't show up to work. So you decided to break into the house and eat chicken? It's lunchtime. Get out. We can stay and help. Get out. No, I have experience. Oh. Get out. I took an internship Ugh. in family counseling. Get out! <laughs> I do not need help destroying my relationship. I was raised by my father. I've completed a 30-year seminar on the power of destroying relationships. Gentlemen, you need to access your personal power. Look within. Now, dinner's not ready. Get the hell out, bitch! Yeah! If you're already up to your ass in the fight, you can be a big person and think, this relationship is over, I'll end it civilly. Or, this relationship is over, might as well crank in a couple of good shots. <laughs> you know how you worry that you're not funny and I said you had a great sense of humor? Well, I was joking. Listen. <laughs> Sound familiar? <laughs> okay, okay, okay. You remember when you confessed to me that you didn't think that you were smart? It wasn't a confession. It was an insight. <gasps> oh, insight, another word you can't spell. <laughs> At least I can read at an eighth grade level. I'd like to see the SAT scores on Mr. Pump and Go. Oh, well, I, I, I never noticed Randy's academic skills. I was too busy watching him tower over me. He's a bodybuilder. <laughs> oh, yeah? Well, Tiffany? Tiffany is a waitress. <laughs> oh, yeah? Oh, yeah? Well, Randy made love to me on his kitchen table. Slow. Strong. It's never been like that with you. Oh. Okay. That's it. Now I'm mad. Get the hell out. What? I think you heard me. I feel bad for you. You know, the way that you were raised. The saddest part about it is, is that you're too weak to overcome it. Nuh-uh. Touche. Ooh. Nah. -uh. The most powerful person in your life is the one that knows all your secrets and your lies and has the power to lift you up or rip out your guts. It's even scarier if she knows your truths. Every woman in your life has left you, starting with your mother. Oh, excuse me. Mothers. Oh, yeah, well, your parents have been married 35 miserable years. Is that better? At least my dad mixes it up a bit. Oh, oh, on behalf of women everywhere, I thank him. Hey, this is not about our parents. Maybe it is. Maybe it is. Somebody taught you how to be afraid of happiness. Maybe it was my mother. Excuse me, mother. Oh, no, 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 no. You are just like your father. Go ahead, go, 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 go ahead, say it. I, Christopher Titus, am my father. And you say, I, Aaron Fitzpatrick, am my mother. I, Christopher Titus, am a lonely, untrusting, angry man. And I, Aaron Fitzpatrick, deserve every crappy thing that's ever happened to me because I'm not good enough to be loved. And I, Christopher Titus, am afraid to love. And I, Aaron Fitzpatrick, had a boyfriend who cheated on me. Oh my God. 
can't believe it. First chance I get, I sleep with a waitress. First chance I get, I sleep with a convenience store clerk. <laughs> We're pathetic. We hate ourselves. It's easy to be in love when you're running through the sprinklers together. Okay, you know the smart thing to do, the adult thing to do, is to end this now. I agree. I'm done. Me too. So it's over. I'm never gonna do this again. Me either. Will you marry me? Yes. Normal people can live with happiness. Screwed up people will try to destroy it. Before, Aaron and I had the perfect relationship. But now, no matter how frighteningly perfect things become or how happy I am, I can relax. Because once, we cheated on each other. And no one can ever take that away. Oh. New table. <laughs> I'm the funny one. No, I'm the funny one. No, I'm the funny one. I'm the funny one. Okay, fine.